60% of our traffic is now mobile, so we clearly need to make sure that everything we do um, and everything we deliver is delivered in a way that our users want to use it. So that means making lots of apps. We're also, you know, uh, not just a website, we are quite a, you know, a brand, I think, in parenting. So there are lots of opportunities to develop what we do to deliver things that make lives easier for parents, which is what our mission is. So uh, watch this space. I agree that everyone's a content creator because uh, really we've built a website out of user-generated content. Um, so our users have been generating content well, for a long time now. Brands also, I think, have made great content. I mean, if you only have to look at the John Lewis ad, to know that there are you know, ads which don't feel like ads, they feel like content that people want to see. And we've worked um, with lots of brands now, mainly on user-generated Mumsnet themes to develop stuff that really fits with their message. So we've done quite a lot um, you know, around, with little around little surprises. We've done, um, we were just doing stuff with Cadbury's around spreading the joy. But it's our, it's, it's our users' content that we curate and match with the right brand. So I think it's more of a partnership uh, than just sticking a bit of branded content on Monster. really picks and chooses what campaigns we as a site get involved with. If our users are really feel strongly about something, and the majority do, and there's a clear plan of action which we will formulate in discussion with them, then we will go guns blazing to do what we can to get government or whoever it is, retailers to listen to us. But we don't sit down at the beginning of the year and think, hmm, what are we going to campaign on? It really is user generated. advertising policy and who we work with has always been uh, decided in conversation with our community. If they feel strongly that a brand that doesn't, uh, doesn't really sit with our philosophy, which is to make parents' lives easier, then we won't work with them. If we think um, there are products out there that we're not sure about whether they fit with our philosophy, we will literally ask our users. A good example is McDonald's. We had a big conversation about McDonald's about 10 years ago, whether they should advertise, and there was a resounding no from our community. But about three years ago, we asked again, thinking McDonald's had done some stuff to maybe make them more palatable and the community gave a resounding yes. So I think we're quite a good barometer actually for brands about how they're doing um, and a good benchmark as to what people think with the, about whether they're making parents' lives easier or not.